In our last task, we created a set of variables, uh, p1x and p1y, that will store uh, the player one's y position. And uh, the reason why we do need to do that is because these sensing sprites get thrown off when the player gets to this location up here, right at the top of the screen, the bottom of the screen, or the sides of the screen. And so we limited the player's uh, movement to within the screen, uh, but that still didn't stop the sprites from moving upward, right? So now we need the sprites to stop moving upward when the player stops moving upward. So the way we're going to do that is we're going to say, um, yeah, sure, go ahead and change his Y position by 5 if, if you press the W key, so move him upward. But if the player is at this location right who's which y, which is a y position of 157 then set this sprite's y position to right here below his foot okay and so we're going to go here to control take out an if statement put it after the change y by 5 and we're going to go into operators and say while no i'm sorry if the player one's y position is greater than 155 which is a bit smaller oh, let me see is that right let's move them all the way to the top yes so if his y position is greater than 155 which means he's at the top of the screen then I'm going to set this sprites I'm gonna say set y to a certain value and now the question is is what value should I set it to well, I want to set it so it's right here below his her, uh, the player's foot, and that looks like about right at 140. So I'm going to come over here and say 140. And let's go ahead and play that and see if it works. So I'm going to go ahead and move upward. You can notice here that the sprite is right there below his right foot. I go up, and it's not working. So the sprite is up here at the top of the screen. Um, so I think it might be because his Y position is at 155 and so 155 is not less uh, greater than 155 so let me change this to 154 which will be true when the player is at the top of the screen so let's go ahead and try that again I go to the top of the screen uh, double click my sprite he's right below the right foot I continue moving up and I'm holding down the W key, but this a sprite is stuck there right below his foot. Right? And so that's great. Right? Um, that fixes the problem. And so now we need, we need to do the same thing here with the A key. And so A key makes the player move to the right. And we need to keep on going until the player gets to right about there. And so we're going to say here if do the same thing right after the change x by negative 5 and we're gonna say if the players x position is less than some value which should be where he's currently at which is this negative 214 so let me put that in here negative 214 then we are going to set this bottom right to his current X position so we're gonna come here to motion and we're gonna say set X to um, and we could tell here with this go to XY that his X is currently at negative 199 so we can set it to negative 200 okay so let's go ahead and see if that works and if that works then we are halfway there so I'm gonna go ahead and move around the screen and move upward and this sprite is right below his right foot. That's good. I move rightward. And the sprite is hanging out. He's probably a little too far to the right. So I'm going to change this not to two, uh, negative 200. I'm going to say set it to negative 210. And if I go ahead and try that again, then we could see that Um, is this the bottom right? Yeah. Actually, let me go ahead and start the game over again with the green flag. 
and so I'm going to the right. I know the top works. Now I'm going to the right, and I double click, and you can see the sprite is right there below his right foot. It looks a little bit off to the left, so I'm going to change this to negative 207 and call it a day. And so that's the process that we need to go through, um, not just for the W key and the A key, but for the S key and the D key. And not just for this sprite, but for all of the sensing sprites. Okay, uh, It seems like a lot of work, uh, but once you get it done, then uh, finally we can go ahead and hit this ball um, the way that it should be uh, hitting. right? Upward when you hit the head, uh, bottom right when you hit the right foot, bottom left when you hit the left foot, and so on. Okay, So it's going to be a lot of work. Uh, but uh, the end result is going to make this game uh, pretty fun to play.